Some of you may be enjoying an extra glass of wine tonight to keep you warm. If you've seen the wine exchange being advertised on social media, don't sign up just yet. New at 9, KCTV 5's Alexis Del Cid has a warning about the viral promise for vino and how it could come back to bite you. Over the past few weeks, you might have seen a post like this on your Facebook feed. It's about a wine exchange. It promises you a big payoff if you mail a wine bottle to a friend, and it's spreading quickly. Many of our staffers here at KCTV5 have gotten this invite. But as with many things, just because you see it on Facebook, does not mean it's a good idea. Erica Hardy loves the giving spirit of the holidays, so when she saw a post, she loved the idea of giving away a bottle of wine. I can give them a bottle of wine, um, and then, you know, if it get, brings them joy and they can enjoy it and put a smile on their face, and that's really what it's about. The Better Business Bureau says gift exchanges like this through the mail can get you into legal trouble because they're actually considered a pyramid scheme by the U.S. Postal Inspector. The people that are participating in these things, they don't have any you know, malicious intent or anything like that, but it's not really even about that. It's just that it, it simply is you know, not a legal thing to do. So they say if you want to exchange wine, just do it the old fashioned way in person, which is what Erica and her friends plan on doing now. We're kind of doing it just kind of an exchange from one person to the other. The Better Business Bureau says these gifts started with chain letters long before any of us had Facebook feeds to check. Another warning, taking part in these wine exchanges can lead to your address ending up in the hands of strangers, something you definitely don't want this holiday season. Alexis Del Cid, KCTV 5 News. And we have more details from the Kansas City Better Business Bureau about red flags to watch out for and how to make sure your information is kept safe. Just head to the KCTV 5 News app and click on Found on 5.